Today we will continue with statistics exercise 14c how to find the median. Question number 6. Uh, before we start you look at the class interval here we have 160, 162, 163. They are not continuous so first we have to make them continuous. How to make continuous see the difference. 162 minus 163 the difference is 1 so since we have 2 class interval we divide by 2 so 2 divide 1 we get 0 0.5 ok so we have to change the class interval into continuous 1 how to do we plus 0 0.5 to upper limit we minus 0 0.5 from the lower limit so here the lower limit is 160 we have to minus <coughs> 0 0.5 160 has no decimal so we can put by ourselves it will become 5 then 9 because we have to borrow from here okay 5 1 so now instead of 160 we have to write 159.5 then 162 is the upper limit we have to plus 0 0.5 here also no decimal so we have to produce ourselves because when we plus remember decimal should be in line so here we have to write like that then here also you see 163 the lower limit we have to minus 0 0.5 so borrow from here 10 minus 5 then this one two six one then upper limit will be 165 plus 0 by 0 0.5 we plus we get 165.5 so if you compare here we see that okay the lower limit here become 162.5 and then this one this one same then the upper one is increased by 5 165 165 no change so that means we now can write by ourselves only this one will become little less 159.5 then this one 162.5 that same one will continue here okay so like that we can arrange it properly <coughs> okay so we can convert it like that so here you can see if we get 162.5 there also will become 162 here we get 165.5 this one we write here then this 168 we increase by 0.5 this one we write here then like that we continue then the number of students already given from the question next we have to find we have to find the cumulative frequency how to find the cumulative frequency the cumulative frequency we have to add as we go down okay so 15 let it remain 15 the first one then for the second one you do 15 plus 118 you get 133 then 133 you add with 142 you get 275 275 you add with 127 you get 402 402 you add with 18 you get 420 here also you plus you see if this one 420 and 420 same mean we do it properly now we can apply the formula so to apply the formula we need to find first the median class we have the total frequency 420 so we divide by 2 so 420 divided by 2 we get 210 so the cumulative frequency which is nearer to this will give us the median class okay so you check from the cumulative frequency what we have we have 210 so where it is near okay if you have exactly 210 you take it if you don't have take greater than it so if compared to all this we see that we have 210 okay so it is this one is less than 210 this one is greater so that means this one will be the median class okay so if you take this as a median class then this one will be the lower limit h which is the class size 
we have to do upper limit minus lower limit. Then F, it is the frequency of the median class. And C, it is the cumulative frequency we have to take, but before the median class. This is the median class before it is 1, 3, 2, 3. So now we can apply the formula. Don't forget to write median equal L plus N by 2 minus C by F into H. L is lower limit of the median class. And the total frequency, C the cumulative before the median class, F frequency of the median class, H is the class size. So L we already have from here, 165.5. N by 2, we finish to divide, so we can write directly 210. C we get 133, F142. Then if we minus this 2, we get 3. So we minus this one and this one, we get this. Then we multiply with 3. So now you divide. If we cannot divide exactly, then you take at least two number after decimal. Then we plus with this one. Be careful when we plus with the decimal, okay? They should be in line. So here 0.5. Then here we have two number after decimal. Here we have only one. So we put one zero so that the decimal will be in line. So finally, we get the answer to be 167.12. Here we have centimeter. So the unit also write centimeter. Then next question number 7. Here also we have to find the median. <clears throat> this is similar. Look here we have 84 then 85. Again they are not continuous. So how <coughs> we have to make it continuous. How to make it continuous? See first by how many caps are there. Okay. So 85 minus 84 1. So same way, 1 if you divide by 2, we get it 0 0.5. So we have to add 0 0.5 to upper limit. We have to minus 0 0.5 from the lower limit. So 75, we minus 0 0.5. There is no decimal, we have to produce it. 10 minus 5 will be 5. And this one now become 4. So instead of 75 now, we have to write 74.5. Then <coughs> upper limit, we have to plus 84.0 plus 0 0.5. So we have 84.5. Okay. Then again, 85, we have to minus from 0.5. Because it's the lower limit. So when we minus, we get 5.484. Here again, you see, these two are equal. That means the upper limit of the first class will be the lower limit of the second class. And then 94.0 plus 0 0.5. 94 remains same, only 5 increase. So in that way, we can rewrite the <clears throat> class interval so those okay the first one will change then second one just increase by five that means upper limit so what we get here you write here here increase 0 0.5 what you have here here okay here increase 0 0.5 what we have here right here here increase 0 0.5 like that continue till the end then frequency already given from the question next we have to find cumulative frequency so 2, you leave it 2, then the next one you do 2 plus 3, 5, then 5 plus 8, you get 13, 13 you plus with 6, 19, 19 with 6, you'll get 25, 25 with 3, 28, 28 with 2, 30. So here the total cumulative frequency, we get 30, there also 30. So now we can find the in order to use the value for median, we have to find the median class. Capital N here, we have 30. To get the median class, we divide it by 2. So 30, we divide by 2, we get 15. So from the cumulative frequency, we have to check where is that 15. Okay, so C. If we don't get exactly 15, you can take greater than. So a number from here which is greater than 15 is 19. So now this one become the median class. 
So the lower limit will be 104.5. H will be this one minus this one. Then F will be 6. C will be the cumulative frequency before median class. It will become 13. So now let us replace it. <coughs> replace in the formula. Okay, so 15 minus 13, we have 2 into 10 by 10. So 2 and 6, you can cancel. 10 divided by 3, then you can plus. After you plus there, here there is no unit. Okay, so that means no need to write unit. Only if you have here, then you write. 